hello everyone welcome to my channel today our topic is about one of the most useful functions in excel so it's count if and count ifs uh, one thing we should always have in our mind that we should use the count ifs function because it's more powerful than count if so with this function we can found the number of specific item in a specific period of time or whatever so I I'm going to apply some formulas here it's easy you just have to focus a little bit first of all I'm going to start from here I want to find the number of orders by state we have three states and I want to find the number of orders in each state so it's easy I just apply here first I want to apply count ifs here equal sign count ifs tab now after that I have to select the range I have to select the range I have to select the state I just try to here state I use the name ranges it's pretty easy comma after that the state I select New York City close the bracket and enter you can see it is the number of orders in New York City so I just simply track this down one of other benefits of name bridges is that it's absolute it doesn't move so when I click on this it's the same if I click here so the next one I want to find the number of orders by customer type so here I use count if not count ifs equal count if I should select the range which is customer type customer type comma so that select this one close the bracket and enter you can see it works the same the formula is the same it works just fine so the next one I want to apply here also count if let's see if it works or not because we have also the ship mode and also the egg we write here equal sign count if and I should select the range first of all the ship mode ship mode comma after that select this and comma the next one I have to select the year range I type here year comma the next one I choose this one so I have to lock this one I just select by click F4 and close the bracket and enter. oops it doesn't work here what should we do that's pretty easy we just we have to use count ifs instead of count if I just add s here tap and enter you can see count x is very powerful and count if if we just use count x it can do the works of counting that's it I drag this down you can see and from here I have I can change the year twenty twenty yes so that's it about count if and count ifs.
Thank you for watching. If you are new here, please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon. Thank you so much.